here I am again. Um, you can tell all the videos have been stockpiled because <laughs> of the weather. Uh, this one um, is a particular Spain on how I would launch my own group of network socialising. So a group of people who wanted to socialise through networks. So in other words, how I would launch my own one of these. Okay, so what I would do uh, to start off with is I'd have one, which is I'd have a, a what I've got is a charter that everybody that joins would sign. The charter basically says um, uh, they'll spread goodwill to others, uh, won't tell other people what to do, um, and I respect everyone's rights to make their own choices. That's more or less the charter. Then, whilst once people have signed up to the charter, we then actually give them support in how to make their own choices. So what I would then do is give everybody in the network a copy of the, of the book, How to Simplify a Choice, which is where I've written down the conscious process that I follow to make sure I make choices about what I do. Here you go, my bells. <laughs> I haven't had them interrupt me for a while. Okay, the third thing I would do to help people set up the network is I'd also point out the fact that, that if they're stuck on their choices, if they're having difficulty simplifying a choice, all of them can go to choiceapprenticeship.com where they can ask uh, me <laughs> how they can simplify their choice so they can make their own choices. Don't tell them what choices to make, I just help them step through the process that's in the book called How to Simplify a Choice. Okay, so the process is really explicit and, and you go through it. Then, as I start setting up and pouring people into it, ideally I'd make sure that the first few, you know, I've put four or five, but it varies depending on what size of the group and whether it's young people or old people and stuff. But So I've got four or five people who already know, who are confident at socialising in network mode. Because um, what they then do is sort of set the pattern. So you might start off with four or five people that know how to do network socialising and then expand it and expand it and expand it until you've got the required number. Okay, um, and that's about it really. Uh, yeah, uh, I have on occasions in, in a working environment sort of hovered around the background uh, and sat with somebody over here and sort of helped write for them just, just to get the, help them get the hang of it and get the hang of it and get the hang of it. So they call me in and say, right, what do I share? How do I make a choice? So it's more face-to-face -face stuff. Um, I've done that in work, and there is face-to-face -face stuff that, that goes on where you just explain all of those stuff face-to-face. -face. Okay, that's basically it, though. That's how to launch your own group of people who do network socialising. Thanks a lot. Bye.